Hi, I'm Randy with BBQGuys.com. Thinking of building your own outdoor kitchen? We always have customers ask us which products we recommend that they choose for their outdoor kitchen. Today we're going to discuss the basic items that are very popular, as well as introduce you to other items you might not have thought about that can definitely add to your enjoyment and entertainment. We've made this video to help provide this guidance. Let's get started with the basics. Almost every outdoor kitchen will start with a gas grill. The grill is typically the focal point and an ideal place to start with the decision making. Next should be some stainless steel access doors for reaching your plumbing for the gas grill. Even the most basic of outdoor kitchens can include the functionality of your indoor kitchen. And to keep yourself from running inside too much, side burners are a great addition for heating sauces and sides. Really just about anything you can cook on your indoor cooktop. A sink for rinsing items and washing hands is quite common as well. Lots of people use single access doors underneath sinks and side burners for easy access to your grill and water plumbing. Another popular component would be a trash bin conveniently placed nearby to dispose of garbage and any food waste. Finally, you can't forget about an outdoor refrigerator to keep your beverages cold for your family and friends when entertaining. Along with a built-in gas grill, many opt to purchase additional cooking appliances for their outdoor kitchen. Don't limit yourself to just a gas grill. If you love fresh baked pizza as much as I do, installing a pizza oven in your outdoor kitchen is a great way to make pizza night an instant family tradition. In addition to a standard side burner, many people enjoy the increased heat output of a power burner. These are great for making stocks, boiling a large batch of seafood, or keeping messy things like frying outdoors. For even more cooking versatility, a flat top griddle is another excellent addition for cooking things like crispy bacon breakfast or hibachi style meals in your backyard. Steaks also come out delicious on the griddle with a beautiful all over sear. If you love having that classic smoky flavor on your food, you may want to consider installing a charcoal grill or Kamado for that old school flavor. We have found our customers love pairing Kamados with their gas grill because of the versatility they bring. Their insulated, oven-like design makes them not only work well as a charcoal grill, but they also make incredible smokers for low and slow cooking. Most would be surprised to know you can even bake cookies in a Kamado. If you want an easy way to smoke food without having to load a grill with charcoal, electric smokers can also be a great cooker to consider building into your island. When it comes to refrigeration within your outdoor kitchen, there are several options to consider in addition to your standard built-in refrigerator. For those that enjoy entertaining, kegerators and wine coolers are very popular. Your guests will love having cold beer on tap, and keep in mind, some kegerators can double as a refrigerator and keg holder when using smaller kegs. If wine is more your taste, a dedicated wine cooler is perfect to keep your collection of red and white wines at the desired temperature. Bar centers can also be a convenient way to add the functionality and the storage you need to keep all of the essentials to a great cocktail in one place. If space is limited, ice bins are a popular option for keeping ice close at hand without taking up as much room as a bar center. A dedicated ice maker is another great addition to any outdoor kitchen. It's always nice not to have to run and pick up extra bagged ice for large parties. To make the most of your outdoor kitchen, Maximize your valuable counter space with built-in storage units to keep everything you need organized and stored away. A lot of customers add a door drawer combo under their grill so that they have concealed storage as well as access to the gas line of their grill. An additional set of storage drawers is always a good bet. I find most people underestimate how much storage they will need in their outdoor kitchen. Enclosed cabinets or pantries are great additions to keep pesky critters from getting to the stuff you're storing inside of them. Lots of enclosed cabinets include pull-out drawers and shelving for easy accessibility. It's nice to be able to keep everything you need for grilling conveniently stored in your outdoor kitchen so it's ready for the next time you cook. Safety is a very important part of the outdoor building process. You need to make sure you have plenty of ventilation and protection for your outdoor kitchen. Ventilation can come in a couple of forms. Island vent panels are an often overlooked necessity. These serve as a way for trapped gas to escape in the case that you have a leak in the gas lines. You will be surprised how many outdoor kitchens get built without vent panels. For outdoor kitchens fueled by propane, vented tank drawers are a good, safe way to house your propane fuel near your appliance. If your outdoor kitchen is built under a covered patio with limited airflow, you will want to plan on installing a vent hood over your grill. 
This will do wonders for clearing out the oftentimes thick smoke that grilling can produce. Lastly, for those who are possibly constructing their island out of wood or any other combustible material, an insulated grill jacket should be purchased. This creates an insulated barrier between your scorching hot appliance and the structure itself. Keeping these things in mind when in the planning stage should provide peace of mind and years of safe enjoyment. Thanks for watching today, guys. If you need any help putting your outdoor kitchen together, give our experts a call or visit us online. And remember, at bbqguys.com, we smoke the competition.